Hey guys, iMovie How To here, and today I'll be showing you how you can add credits to your iMovie on iOS project. So what you need to first do is determine if you want your credits to be over a still image or over an existing clip in your project. So you first want to estimate roughly how long you want your credits to be. So you can roughly estimate by the length of this clip, that section right here, let's say I want my credits to be 10 seconds, I can just tap here, make sure I'm on this tab right here, and then I tap split, splits this into around a 10 second clip, and let's say I want two titles on my credits, what I can do is I can go roughly in the middle here, and click on split again, and then it puts it into roughly five second chunks. Okay, so in order to actually bring up the credits interface iMovie has, what you need to do is you need to click on the T icon. So you, need, you need to tap on the clip first, and then tap on the T icon right here. And then click on this first title that's next to this None button. And then there's three buttons down here that says Opening, Middle, and Closing. You want to tap on Closing. And there it will display the closing title for your theme, or the credits title in other words. So then to edit it, basically, you, go, you click on the title, which in this case is next to the magnifying glass icon. And then here you can just add some credit text. Keep in mind this isn't the only credits template. There's other templates for other themes. This is just a credits template for the simple theme. If you pick another theme, it may have a different style to it. So then we, what you can do, you can do the same thing for the next clip. Click on this title right here. Tap on closing on the area near the magnifying glass. Not on the magnifying glass, but on the near, area near it. Click on the X, clear it if you want. And there you go. So that's basically how you can add credits to your iMovie and iOS project. Thank you for watching this iMovie and iOS tutorial. If you liked this video, or thought this video was helpful, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. This video was actually inspired by a comment left on one of my videos, so if you have any other tutorial suggestions, be sure to leave them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.